This is Total Television. I'm Brian Dolby and I'm reporting from Colts headquarters in London where I'm delighted to be speaking to Mirko Voltolini. Mirko, Colt has got a fantastic reputation for its network right across Europe. Tell us a bit about its current state and, and how you got to, to where you are today. Okay, so the network for us is uh, really one of the foundation what we call our information delivery platform, our European information delivery platform. Together with uh, our data center is uh, is a, a one of uh, our main assets, uh, so as well as with with the people, uh, we have uh, grown uh, from uh, just a city, London, to 21 countries plus the U.S. Uh, we have uh, over 30,000 of uh, kilometers of uh, fiber fiber network across Europe, uh, uh, metropolitan network in 38 uh, cities. Uh, so quite a, quite a large asset. Uh, we have uh, started with uh, traditional. Uh, voice and data services. We now have uh, quite a large portfolio of services covering uh, everything that uh, business customer needs today. And, and what do you think about business customers tomorrow? What are the areas that you're sort of moving into? Anything to do with cloud computing, for example? Yes, exactly. So cloud computing is, is becoming quite uh, important uh, for uh, customers. Uh, it starts with uh, the retail business, uh, but is now moving into the, 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 the higher end type of business. Uh, we uh, have, uh, as I said, uh, a large uh, data center uh, real estate in Europe, 19 data centers, so we can, we can uh, couple our network services together with our IT services. So uh, private cloud is becoming quite important uh, for, for that. So you're very well placed by the sound of it with all that data uh, capability. Yes, we are. One of the challenges that we have is that we need to be able to, to transform our business to be able to uh, reap this opportunity. We uh, we have uh, uh, a number of processes that uh, that uh, needs to be aligned to be able to to address this type of uh, proposition. What do you think about the network? The way things are going. What are the next challenges facing people like yourselves in terms of keeping uh, customers satisfied with all their uh, bandwidth demands? Uh, yeah. So network uh, traffic is growing quite quite fast. Uh, video services. Uh, uh, and also cloud services are pushing more traffic into the network. Uh, we need to be able to sustain this growth, uh, so innovation is quite important in this space, so pushing more bits uh, into the fiber, but also utilizing the existing uh, capacity in a more efficient way, so to be able to dynamically allocate bandwidth uh, between uh, different locations, so increase or decrease the size of the, the connection, so that's uh, one of the key innovations. Uh, we also need to simplify the way we deliver uh, services. Uh, uh, today we we can reduce the number of uh, technology layers that we use uh, to deliver uh, uh, data services. Uh, technologies like, like optical uh, and, and packet-based technology are coming closer and closer together, so we'll, we'll be able to benefit from that. Well, Boko, thanks very much for giving us an update here at Total Television. Thank you. Mm -hmm.